And we're just here trying to help pick up valuables, whatever we can save for them, clothes, um, and do whatever we can because we love them. And uh, they're alive. A lot of people didn't make it out, so it's devastating in this area. It's just heartbreaking. For everybody that it occurred to, I mean, you can't you can't say anything else. You just you feel like a big hole. So we just pray for everybody else too. Just a terrible disaster, you know, something that nobody could control. You know, it just, just kind of just ripped this town apart, really. So, uh, you know, we just came here together as a community. You know, we thought, you know, this is what this is what we do. This is what Borgard's about. If, if this place, if it could happen anywhere else, they picked the best place to pick it because this, this is a tight knit community. It's, it's just seeing seeing houses just totally ripped apart, you know, from their foundation, you know, knowing that there could be kids in that house. You know, knowing that there have been kids that have lost their life during this, and, you know, it just, it just breaks my heart because most of these kids, you know, I've I've known their parents for a long time. I've known them, you know, so it, you know, it really breaks my heart. You know, some kids who have died. Yeah. Um, so one of my buddies from my graduating class, his little nephew, he passed away. He was six.